The deadly flooding in Colorado continues as thousands are being evacuated. Our Dave Malkoff is at the University of Colorado in Boulder. Hi, Dave. What's the latest? Now, you've seen the raging waters here in Boulder, Colorado, but what you can't get at home is the speed that those waters are coming through town, not just on the streets, but here in the Boulder Creek, which is now the Boulder Rapids, until you have something that's relative to the water around it. I'm going to show you how fast it's going and the swirling pattern that you see. If you just drop this in here, you can see how fast that's moving and how fast it's swirling around. That's what's happening to not just that beach ball. Look at how fast that's going down there. And it is gone. And all of the debris that's flying through here. When it's swirling around, it gets caught up and creates these little dams that eventually do erode away and break open. And then you have another gush of water coming down. The Colorado Department of Transportation has told me that the problem is not just the water, but the debris itself that's in the roadways. That's why when the water recedes, they can't just open up those roadways because they have all that debris there and you don't know what you're driving over. We will have more reports from Colorado coming up as we drive around town and really gather the sense of what's happening in this disaster. In Boulder, I'm Dave Balkoff, The Weather Channel.